Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to make a very high power uh, lab bench power supply. So for the power source, I'm using a UPS transformer. So this transformer is rated for 600 watts. And uh, if we check the output voltage, so it's uh, like 12.9 volt. It's almost uh, 13 volts AC. And uh, the current uh, of this transformer is maximum of uh, here you can see the short circuit current is uh, peaking over 60 amperes so it's a very huge current for any electronic circuit so for the protection of this transformer as well as the whole power supply i'm using a short circuit protection for uh, this power supply which is uh, based on lm358 and also i made in my previous video so here i'm using a 5 volt relay for switching this transformer AC and uh, to protect from overheating and uh, also the short circuit so here uh, you have noticed that uh, I am connecting in the primary side which is the 220 volt side because the uh, reason behind this is uh, because the transformer gives uh, over 50 amperes of current so for uh, switching such high current it requires also very high power relay and uh, for the if very if you can see i'm using a small relay but in the high side so the current will be like uh, one ampere or two amperes maximum and uh, it's a very uh, less expensive than uh, using high amperes of uh, and a high power relay and uh, here you can see i'm uh, connecting the relay to my common and uh, normal open points so after this, I am connecting the relay coils uh, wire to my protector circuit which will go to the 4 volt with DC and uh, ground. So here in the back side, the negative which is output through the BC547 transistor and uh, positive 4 volt circuit. So after this, I am uh, connecting the module to throw this my full vibrative fire which uh, will give a very smooth dc at the output and uh, have a rating of uh, 40 amperes so here i am uh, completed all the circuit and uh, connection so to activate the short circuit protection i am uh, connecting the output of this uh, transformer power supply to my protector circuit so the sun tracer used to sense the output current so that uh, it will turn on and off the whole power supply through the relay to protect from short circuit and uh, any kind of uh, heating. So here you can see uh, when I sort the output but it's not uh, uh, closing because the current limit by the potentiometer is very high. But now I have uh, decreased the current limit so the power supply becomes uh, shut down fully and uh, you can see when i press the reset switch which uh, given on the pre-cv it will activate the whole power supply and uh, when i sort the output of this power supply so it's uh, like uh, 90 more dc and uh, you can see it's instantly shut down the whole system so it will protect from uh, burning of uh, any kind of wire and uh, etc so here uh, I'm testing uh, some load with this power supply. So see the regulation and it's working and uh, or not properly. So I have connecting the um, climb meter through the output to AC. So here uh, I am setting the output current limit. So here we can see when I sort the output it will turn on fully. So the load testing here, I'm using a high power RO water pump motor. So it's uh, when I turn on the power supply, you can see the motor is rotating properly and uh, the current is uh, 6 ampere in the input side, which is a very high ampere at uh, now because the voltage is like almost uh, 20 volts. So the current uh, at which uh, like 6 ampere and 20 volts uh, almost uh, uh, very high power at the output 
so here i'm testing the dc motor which is 12 volt and now you can see the current consuming maximum of 2 amperes but now i am decreasing the current limit so when i try to stop the motor it will sense the short circuit or over current so that it will turn off the power supply fully so it will protect the whole circuit from any kind of uh, short circuit and uh, else so also you can see when the power supply is running in normal mode but when the uh, sudden short circuit occurs it will turn off the fully so this is the very uh, usual for any power supply so if you like this video please like and uh, share your opinion in the comment box and also subscribe to my channel and uh, thanks for watching